In various episodes of our Woodcademy TV show, you've seen me use dowel centers to transfer holes from the end of one part into another. And they work awesome for that. But there's another option for transferring holes, and those are transfer punches like these, which allow you to transfer when there's a hole through a piece, like this jig, to mark another piece underneath it. So let's look at how they differ and why you would choose one over the other. Transferring locations of blind holes, especially those in the ends of parts, is what dowel centers were designed for. And they're exactly the right tool to use for this job. Dowel centers can also be used with through holes, as with this drill guide. But by design, the dowel centers extend beyond the face of the guide, which makes it a little more difficult to accurately line up before making the impression that transfers the hole locations. And dowel centers only come in the four standard dowel sizes, half, three-eighths, five-sixteenths, and quarter, which limits their flexibility. Transfer punches are obviously not suitable for blind holes like the dowel centers are, but they allow for parts and jigs to be accurately placed and even clamped before use. In many cases, this makes them easier and more accurate. And transfer punches come in an indexed set that are sized to match drill bits so they can be used with most of the holes that you'll need to drill. They can even be used for determining the size of an existing hole. Then instantly used to mark the matching drill location. And transfer punches are also useful during assembly. They make it easy to align holes between different parts, speeding the assembly process. Although they perform similar functions, both dowel centers and transfer punches deserve a place in your shop.